Hey, what is up, guys? It is Halt, and all I gotta say is, every time I load in, these stupid things come up. I'm not gonna get your damn skyfires. Fuck off. Thank you, that is all. Um, I wish there was a way to be like, yeah, I don't want skyfire tokens. Or, like, you can say which ones you don't want. It's almost like you could ha have targeting advertisement advertisements. Because, like, there's a chance that I would get tokens for like certain things. I'm not going to say what, but I'm not going to freaking get tokens for something I don't even need. So that's all. All right, and that's the video guys. Thanks for watching. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I lied to you. What's up nerds? It's Chief and today we're watching some playbacks of the base hitting. So my base hitting got a lot uh defense got a lot better. Um also that nerd's comment, we're playing the same game. So, yeah. I just did this like two seconds ago. So it covers my whole island basically now. Except for the little corner right there. So, if you're going to hit me, pinch the corner. Or, maybe, I don't know. I still don't know how long. I don't think the splash will get that far. But, hey, that's probably the only place that you'll be able to pinch. Unless you get a lucky pinch in. Um, so here's the first hit. Yeah, because uh, I just did that because I realized that it was not, first of all, I had I was a dumbass. So when I was doing my overhauls on my base, uh, I decided that I was going to just change it to that and not give myself extra um, range. So, I didn't have range. I only had... Uh, I had extra damage, which is it's a defensive turret. It doesn't do damage. So anyway, so this first hit was interesting. As you can see here, is V-Pride, Pride, and three rages. So, here he comes. First three rages. And this, at this point, I actually had... Uh, I was in the middle of refitting my base when this happened. So I have one here. Uh, I want to axiom here. This thing was a radioactive turret, but I took the radioactive turret off. Was about to put on another axiom, and I got hit. So, yeah. I think I was getting base parts. I think I needed like a hundred thousand more base parts to do it, and then I got hit, and then I was like, "Well, shit." But as you can see by the picture I showed you, I do win this one. Yeah, so he died before he even got to my tide. And here we go. Here's the pride, which is so funny to watch. Yeah. I don't know what he thought he was doing with that. Like, why would you... First of all, why would you send the V-Pride in first? Um, though I think it actually survives longer. Funny enough. Yeah, see survived longer so there we go tom l you tried not bad i mean i leveled him so i give him respect for hitting me back oh son of a bitch i don't want to watch tom l hit again but kicks i listen to my button clicking so here we go guys tom l is going to hit again but i think i can get out of it all right Okay, there we go. So this one was oh ye nasty bastard. He's failed in my base so many times now. It's quite humorous. He's an idiot. Uh, he looks like some Albert Einstein looking motherfucker. Like, holy shit. Like, <laughs> I'll show you the picture. But this dude, my goodness. What are you, yeah, see, you can see it in the corner right there. Like, Albert Einstein ass looking motherfucker. Um, yeah, and he keeps telling me that, like, my Tide Seeker here is a glitch, and I shouldn't be able to be using that, and that it shouldn't have been as good as it was, and stuff like that. So at this point, I have this in. I do not have the specials on. Um, and I don't think I added them for a little bit, because I forgot that I didn't add them. Because, like I said, I'm super busy with class. So anyway, so this is what he does here, is he does this little stacking thing. Pretty cute. And then he messed it all, it got all messed up because of the pinched, because, you know. Yeah, so here comes a rocket, and as you see, it pinches right on top. 
because I have this here. Um, and I didn't even learn after this hit. I was like so busy talking shit to this guy. I didn't even think about the fact that he pinched my base and that I can make my base better by fixing that. So anyway. Sometimes I wonder why I even have the justice in there. Um, so yeah, he hits that, and then here he comes. So he's like, oh, I'm going to kill your tight Seeker. But bam, that thing sh unshrouded. Then he's coming around with this. And he actually gets pretty close. But then he unshrouds now. Oh, no, he just died there. Yep. So that that's what, that shows you right there is he actually got really close with that pinch and I was like damn and it actually wasn't that close in the video he was actually dead already I thought or when I watched it live but he got pretty close in that hit um still died so yep and I know my base probably isn't indestructible but I can keep out like what 99% of players so and even that even more maybe like 99.5% of players um i saw one rage fleet that i wouldn't put my money against but uh for getting in my base wiggy 73 so what did he hit me with probably rages everybody's using rages nowadays it's all the rage anyway so yeah, here we go Oh, I'm almost at 500 medals, by the way. So that's awesome. The more people see, I guess, the higher, higher, the better players are gonna keep hitting me. The more, though. So I mean, the more medals I get, the better players will hit me. So yeah. So maybe better builds. Uh, so I really need to get this changed up into a better ship, and I need a. Uh, this has zero rank. That has some rank. But I definitely need to rank those up. They have no armor, though. Um, so, yeah. I kind of need to get that done. Also, it was really annoying. He sat here. He must have got booted or something. But I remember this because I was watching this. I was like, dude, wasting my time. Uh, right. So... And as you can see, I'm already damaged down here because I popped. So I got hit a ton in the past couple of days. So, yeah, here we go. Oh, there was one really funny hit. I'll have to show you what happened uh, later, actually, I guess. I think Wiggy73, he didn't even give him any medals. I was pretty sad. I hate it when I get hit and I get no medals for killing him. So, yeah, here he comes. Eventually, he's smart though. He's not being stupid. He need, he knows he needs all the health he can get. So, he too pinches. I don't remember that. Let's see if he pinches the same area. Probably like right there, right? Yeah. Okay. So like right there. Right at the edge of my range at the time. So he pinches as well. <laughs> Obviously, though, he's not as good as hitting. Uh, at hitting. Also, watch this. So they go down and boom. Look at that. Holy crap. He just died almost. So anyway, so then he's coming and coming. He's getting shot at again. And for some reason, he reshrouds, which was kind of annoying. Um, but anyway, so he dies there, and then the Reina Shroud's right here, so that sucked. Um, yeah. So as soon as he unshrouds, he's dead, he knows that, so yeah, there you go. So they're all dying about right here, as, you'll, as you've noticed. Um, but those are with the pinch, with a pinch, so hopefully when I, now that I've fixed it, It'll be a little bit better, but we'll see. So C Fox was a scout, zero percent. This was not a scout, and this is what I'm talking about. It was freaking hilarious. 
I was in my base at the time, and I feel bad. I shouldn't have been in my base. I, I should have just let him, like, English. And I literally, like, watch the health bar, guys. Watch the health bar, because I might not be able to get over qu quick enough for you to see what happened. Yeah, see, he's already dead. And if I can get over there. Yeah, he had liberators. So, um, I'll show you, <laughs> show you the... What was what he actually had? Um, uh, yeah, Inquisitor, Inquisitor, Liberator, Liberator, Liberator. They just freaking melted. So he probably had like no armor. But oh my goodness! All right, so I'm not gonna show you this hit or this prep here, because it was literally just. You'll see what he did when you threw this hit, and you'll notice that it's like, oh, that's not even uh, worth it. That's not worth watch. That. Let's not waste your time. Um, he took uh, that much damage. So freeze if you want to watch, see how much damage he got from that. And just to show you, he did re uh, coin repair his fleet. So yes, that's that. So this is what he did. He took out this stuff. And he took out that. And that is still up. So, there he goes. I'm officially bubbled. Kills that pretty easily. I don't even know why I have this stuff up here sometimes. Like, I could literally just have, like, thud, not thuds, uh, howitzer ones. Um, alright, so here we go. He pinches. I thought he pinched. Maybe he pinches later in the hit. Yep, there he goes. So that's a bold move. He pinches later in the hit. And one ship's already down. And he's like, this was a mistake. So he pinches me. However, you can already see. GG, man. GG. Though, he actually did a lot better than normal. Um, and I have a feeling I know how to get in my base. Uh, so yeah, I was able to kill him. And then I think he kills my tide. That's his Reina right there. Reina is like one of the few things to actually do much damage. So yeah, it dies right there. So he did the farthest in my base. And after that, I was like, you know what? They keep getting like far enough to hurt my warehouses. And this is the first guy that actually killed my whole fleet in defense. So I was like, you know what? I need to make some changes. I'll let me figure out what I did wrong with that pinch. So I can't get pinched anymore. So, I think I am pinch resistant now, but I'm sure the next guy come in and will try and pinch me. Who knows? Maybe I'll ask a friend to test it. So, thanks for watching, guys. Please don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe for more base defense attacks and whatnot. I'm sure I'll have, like, four or five new defense videos, like, in the next couple of days. So, yeah. It's kind of nice being hit and winning. Uh, yeah. Thanks for watching again. Uh, peace off, guys.